From Uttar Pradesh, let's get you all the action from Punjab this morning. What dominated headlines yesterday was the raids by the Enforcement Directorate on Chief Minister Chani's relative. Now the information we're picking up is that the ED has made a massive seizure after that particular raid. The Enforcement Directorate has seized 6 crore rupees of cash from Chani's nephew Bupinder Singh Hani's residence in Ludhiana. Another 2 crore rupees was also seized from a second location in Ludhiana. Now the reason that you've got Chani's nephew under the scanner is because the ED suspects that there was investment of black money in his firm. There are also questions about sand mining contracts being given out illegally and the firm belonging to Chani's nephew receiving contracts worth hundreds of crores. So all of this is being looked into. The captain said that my cabinet is a lot of people माफिया का हिस्सा है तभी कार्रवाई होनी चाहिए हुई थी हम भी कहते रहे कि चन, चन्नी साहब के हलके में चमकौर साहब में इलीगल माइनिंग चल रही है चन्नी साहब को ऐसा नहीं हो सकता चन्नी साहब को नहीं पता अभी जो रेड्स हुई हैं उनके रिश्तेदारों के घर पे तो उससे पता चल गया ना कि चन्नी साहब सिर्फ गिल्ली डंडा या खंभे पे चढ़ना या अपने आप को ऐसे साबित कर देना कि मैं तो बहुत ही मतलब आम आदमी हूं ये वो उनके घर पर ईडी की रेड हो रही है ये तो कहा जाए कि मुख्यमंत्री का रिश्तेदार गैर कानूनी माइनिंग का काम क्यों कर रहा था ये तो सवाल हो सकता है लेकिन ये तो सवाल ही गलत होगा कि ईडी जो है मुख्यमंत्री के या रिश्तेदार हो या उसका दोस्त हो या कोई भी जो गलत काम कर उस पे छापा क्यों मारे ये तो सवाल ही गलत होगा ईडी एक इंडिपेंडेंट जो है एजेंसी है ना तो और बड़ी बात क्या है कि दो में जब ये केस शुरू हुआ था अगर आपके संज्ञान में हो तो कैबिनेट में बहुत शोर मचा था लड़ाई हुई थी और ये कहा गया था कि चन्नी इन्वॉल्व है इसके अंदर तो तब चन्नी जी ने यह भी कहा था कि मैं गुरुद्वारे कसम खा लेता हूं मेरे रिश्तेदार नहीं है now, in election season, when this kind of a raid is conducted by the Enforcement Directorate, it leads to a massive political showdown. It's pretty much the same script that's been followed here in Punjab as well. Soon after the raids by the Enforcement Directorate, you had the Congress hitting out at the BJP, claiming that this was all motivated. Charanjit Singh Chani, the Chief Minister, said that Mamta's skin were also similarly raided before the West Bengal election, so all of this is politically linked. The BJP said, do not view these raids through a political lens. This has nothing Nothing to do with the elections. Besides that, the chief minister also said that the enforcement directorate is very clearly targeting and harassing the opposition, any other party besides the BJP. Sambit Patra of the BJP responded saying Sidhu also raised this very issue that someone from within the Congress also said that sand mining and illegal sand mining must be looked into. Uh, Channi has said that the ED is mounting pressure on the Congress with weeks to go for the elections. Sambit Patra has responded saying do not politicize the fight against corruption and the crackdown against corruption. Remember, it's Channi's relative, his nephew, who's been raided. And Channi's maintained that this is an attempt to intimidate him as well as the Congress. Let's take this across to Kamaljit Sandhu. She's joining us live with the latest updates on this. Kamaljit, good morning. You know, there were a lot of questions about what kind of evidence the agency had, what kind of evidence the ED had to go ahead with these raids. And now the information we're picking up is that, uh, you know, nearly six crore rupees has actually been picked up so far. Well, the raids were carried out in 10 different locations in Punjab, including Ludhiana, Pathan Court, and Mohali. We've been told at least six crores, four of them from Bhuvinder Singh Hani, who's a nephew of Chief Minister Charanjit Singh Channi. Now, this has started a fresh political storm. Uh, the Congress already fighting dissent within the party has a fresh controversy to face. They, however, are putting up a brave face, especially the Chief Minister Charanjit Singh Channi. Uh, he says uh, this is the sort of tactics Modus Apprenda, which was taken by BJP in West Bengal, where Mamta Banerjee's relatives were targeted. There were raids conducted. Similarly, it's happening in Punjab and saying uh, that they're clean, that the Punjabis aren't scared of anyone. Meanwhile, uh, the Congress party came in the defense saying uh, this is the tactics of the BJP. This is intimidation. That's what is being done to the Congress workers, to the Congress party. But meanwhile, these are serious allegations. All political parties are jumping into this entire controversy, blaming the Congress party. So this is going to be very difficult to fend off at a point of time where both the BJP, the Aam Aadmi Party, the others are going guns blazing against the Congress party who have little defense. One is the sort of recovery which has been made by the ED. The other part is the involvement of a direct relative of Chief Minister Charanjit Singh Chani. These are two undeniable facts. Now one is 
how the case proceeds would be uh, together all together different because they're saying this is a political okay. uh, but here in punjab many are seeing this as a political raid of sorts this is to undermine congress's chances right here in polbound state all right uh, kamal ji thank you for the moment for joining us with all of those details